Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get a Rapid Streams application to your Fire Stick or Android TV. It's an amazing application that a lot of people use to watch live TV online. I just had to blur out my screen because YouTube doesn't allow me to show you the exact channels available in the application. But trust me, you are going to like it. So now, without any further ado, let me show you how to get Rapid Streams to your device. First of all, you have to get an app called Unloader. You can actually get it for free from the official Amazon App Store. To do so, just go to search on your device, here it is, open it, and start typing the Unloader in the search bar. As you can see, there was even no need to enter the whole name of the app, because the Unloader already popped out for us at the bottom. So we click on the Unloader, and that's the app which you need to get to your device. However, after you get the Unloader, it's not over yet we still have to set it up. So to set up the loader, we'll go to settings. Let's do it right now. Click on that button with the gear icon, then scroll down and go to My Fire TV. Open it. Here you'll have to enable developer options on your device. However, on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new ones, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case, do not worry, it's really easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you have to click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times and do it fast, so let's do it. As you can see, now the button for me says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. And in your case it's going to say that you have become a developer now. So if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options. Which is exactly what we're looking for. So we open them, make sure to enable ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps. From here, locate the loader and turn that option on. So what it does, it's going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those apps which are only available in the official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now let's go to the list of apps on your device. There it is, open it. And here you'll find the loader, which is a top and ready to use on your device. But before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which I always recommend doing. It's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN. Because they're super fast, they got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they're not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In the VPN app, you just connect to any server, let's say we'll connect to Canada right now, and from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means nobody can track you or snoop on you online, and that's really important if you want to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in a pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get three months of my VPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN, with 3 months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now, with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you the same deal for Nord. And now finally let's use the loader safely. So we gotta open the downloader application, there it is, open it. There on the left side menu you have to click on home and not on browser. So once again make sure to click on home and there in that search bar we're gonna enter a link which is going to be rapidstreams.co. So let's enter it. So once again, the link is rapidstreams.co, you can see the whole link on your screen right now, so make sure to enter it exactly as you see and do not make any mistakes, because obviously if you make any mistake, your link is not going to work. After that, you have to click on go, and while the website is loading, make sure to subscribe my channel so you could get even more content about Fire Sticks, as well as hit the like button below this video. It truly really helps me a lot and this way I'll be able to create even more content for you. And now, after the website opened, we have to scroll down a bit until we see that download app now button. We click on it, and in a couple of moments, we download should start. 
Usually that doesn't take long, but of course it all depends on your connection speed. As you can see, in my case, it's happening pretty fast. Then just click on install and wait until Rapid Streams is installed to your Fire Stick or your Android TV. After that, don't click on open yet, instead press on done, because here we'll have an option to delete the installation file, as we don't really need it anymore on our device. So click on delete and then delete once again. This way we get rid of unnecessary installation files from your Fire Stick and save you some free space. Now finally let's go to the list of apps on your device. There it is, open it. Then scroll down, and here you'll find Rapid Streams, which we just installed to your device. Now I would recommend you to click on the Options button on your remote. That's the button of three horizontal lines. Click on it, and then press on Move to Front. This way, Rapid Streams is always going to be at the very top of your application list, and therefore it's going to be super easy for you to access the app every time you need it. Just don't forget to keep your VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble. Enjoy and see you next time. Bye bye.